respected Rashtrapati ji, I would rather prefer to call him our beloved Pranabda. Dr. Ramaswamy, Secretaries to the Government of India, Officers of Ministry of Science and Technology, and Rashtrapati Bhavan, Teachers, Inspire Award winners, children members of the media team, friends, ladies and gentlemen, very good day to all of you. Let me add my own words of welcome to the Honorable President and all of you to this function on behalf of our ministry. Sir, by the very act of slotting time for interactions with the winners of Inspire Awards, you have been conveyed a strong message to the country in favor of science and faith in the youth of the country. Inspire includes a total of five components spanning the age group of 10 to 32 inspire award component targets children in the age group of 10 to 15 it strives to connect 100 percent of all middle and high schools in the country i'm happy that all the 28 states and seven universities uh, sorry seven Union territories have already enrolled into a scheme. Nearly nine lakh awards have been sanctioned so far. Those of you who have been invited to this program have been selected, dear children, from a group of nearly 5.2 lakh people of your age group. I am delighted to know from the ministry that nearly 230 entries from the two national level competitions conducted so far in 2011 and 2012 are being processed for filing patents for the INSPIRE awardees. There are some potential discoverers and inventors amongst you. The present generation of youth is what I call as the next best generation of India. Children, all of you are building the cathedral called India of the future. India should emerge. Here, I would like to vary the phrase or metaphor. We are also building, to put in the words of Jawaharlal Nehru, an ultra modern temple of new technology and science. Children, all of you will emerge as global leaders, for India to emerge as a leader, our youth must believe in themselves and work hard. You are the next best generation, not only of India, but also of the world. You remember that you need to change India for the best. You need to transform this nation away from the mindset of perpetual anguish and comparison syndrome to one of leadership aspiration. To me, Swami Vivekananda was not a person. He was a realization. He realized the power of youth, and he said, my faith is in the younger generation. And out of them will come my workers. They will work out the whole thing like lions. 
children i sincerely believe that science and technology and innovation would form the next level of transformational change in the world therefore i call upon you that some of you try to become scientists would participate in the transformational change of india for the better future to the tools of science our ministry will do everything possible for those of you wishing to become scientists to realize your own potential my best wishes to all of you thank you very much